Okay, heavy all systems are online and you're ready for takeoff. Are you sure you're up for this? Yes, engineer. Doctor wants me to go to planet Subnautica and do that I will. Okay, well where you'll be heading is a different bomb. Not where Devilman used to be stranded in. I know, engineer. I know where I am going. It is cold and cruel, but Heavy's got this! Alright, let's go. I'm entering the planet's atmosphere. It seems the- oh, oh. Ah! Engineer, we got a problem! I've been hit! I'm losing altitude! Oh. Let me just pull up and find a place to land. I'm trying. Oh! Heavy, are you okay? Are you still alive? Oh! Heavy already hates flying spaceship. Oh! Heavy, you gotta get out of that pod. It's catching on fire. I got to get out of here. This won't open. Get me up. Huh? Ah! <sighs> this region of the planet are like the polar ice caps and as cold as Siberia in Russia. I got to see if I can find any food, water, or supplies around here. Alright, heavy after that, see if you find the life pod. Engineer, what are you doing here? We need to do some security shift at the parking. Hello, Demon Hey, Teddy, where the hell are you? Well, you see, we. Medic and Engine gave me a mission to head back to Planet Subnautica to explore more of the planet and collect the end of different species. They fucking what? They also want me to find someone, a woman by the name of Sam. Medic told me that Henry Rule and Sam are acquainted with each other, saying that she has a talent, genetics, and much more secrets. Medic and Engine are fucking insane, sending you to the planet that I never wanted to go back to and what secrets. We've already discovered the planet's secrets a very long time ago. Well, not all of them. What do you mean, not all of them? Medic said that Sam has found something that has to do with the alien facilities. When I find her and take the other samples, I'll be heading home. Oh, I see. We'll be careful. Heavy you saw what I saw back at Planet Subnautica. Just don't die. I want demo. Here we go. Huh? <laughs> This region's ocean seems to be more dark and cold, not like what you used to experience them all. We see that heavy now just head to your life pod to see if you can get yourself some supplies. Before you begin exploring and finding Sam, you're gonna need supplies. Yes, so heavy finds it stupid that I can't take my weapons with me. I agree, when I was at that planet, I couldn't even take my damn grenade launcher or my samurai sword with me. I'm a Sasha already, though I'm sure I'll survive this. I may not have Sasha, but I still have my feet. Well, maybe one day I'll have to see Fighter Reaper Leviathan, because I claim that throne since I faced that many other creatures. You may be the king of the seas in a different sea. Well, maybe, maybe Harry can be the king of the glaciers of the sea. Boys, boys, we have to focus on the mission here. Well, honestly, I disagree on that idea that Medic and Engine want to send Heavy to Planet Subnautica because I'll have two DNA samples instead. Guys, I found this little baby penguin like creature. I don't think that's a good idea oh. holding its baby like that. Yeah, don't do what Mario does to baby penguins. You'd be a cruel person, Heavy. Oh, I'm not gonna drop it. Take it for dinner. It might taste like chicken. Heavy, what the hell is wrong with you? Why are you pulling a Mario 60 for move? We see that these penguins are very protective of their offspring. Those who grabs the babies will get hurt from what it looks like. Well, even so, at least I found a life ball that fell out of my ship. Oh, great, Heavy, here's some tips you should know. You're also gonna need some flipper and a sink light to get to places faster, but you also need a scanner. If you have a scanner, and if you scan some parts of a vehicle as such, you unlock its blueprints to build them. Great. Demo, when you planning to stick around? Oh, sure, why not? I have to be there for Heavy since he's on that planet. I should might as well be his guide when it comes to survival. I'll even do my best to give him some tips. Thank you, Demo Man! I'll see what I can do to prepare myself for medic and engine research. Later. Oh, right, guys, I went to a beacon that said emergency supply run. I'm gonna do what they have. Good idea, Heavy. You don't wanna run out of rations, water, and possibly not miss good supplies around here. Yes, although if Engine wanted me to go to Planet Subnautica, why can't they send their own equipment?
I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. I can't shake the feeling. This planet is cursed. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave. Not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. Something ain't right. Oh, what the hell? Holy shit, Heavy, are you okay? I don't have them all. I'm frozen. I can't move. Heavy, just stay calm and wait for the ass to move. <laughs> What the hell was that? It's not that cold in the ocean. From the looks of that fish, it must have had ice breath that can freeze you solid. Note yourself, everything on this planet is aggressive. All I have to grind another plate and I'm gonna see if I can go deeper. Well, don't go to deep heaven because everything on that planet wants to kill you. The deeper you go, the more dangerous it gets. Want my advice? Down there, see if there's a vehicle part. Maybe a sea moth would be helpful. Well, sadly, Demo, they're not using sea moths anymore. What do you mean they don't use a sea moth? A while ago, Altair upgraded their vehicles to a sea truck. What's a sea truck? The sea truck is a modular undersea vehicle, somewhat resembling a submersible train. Demo man, do you recognize this structure? Oh, I haven't seen these structures in a very long time. Not since I said goodbye to the sea emperor. God rest her soul. Who well, is that the case we need to see more? Well, it's a good and bad at the same time. We don't know what we're dealing with, and if you get infected, you'll know where the Sea Emperor's children would be. And you don't want to get infected, trust me, lad. Well, we will never know. Just follow the lights and let us know if you find something. All right, Engineer. Hope there's no death trap to this. Sounds like wherever this light is leading us, it's setting alarm. Well, why is the alarm set off? I don't know, maybe something must have broken out or broken in. Or something's within this facility is unleashed. There's a found alien facility. We see it heavy once you enter to watch out for traps and see if you can find some other things that maybe I didn't discover. Hello! Is someone here? Heavy, we're Heavy! Heavy, are you here? The facility's interfering with our, our radio. Sorry, Heavy! You're on your own! Hold oh, the gun! Don't die! Don't worry, Heavy's got this! Who are you? Show yourself, you coward! So you don't have a physical form? Why are you being a coward alien robot? Are you some sort of architect? I can help only if you give me info on my iPad thingy. Oh, Terra! No, my equipment is from it. Oh, from engine. It sucks that this place has interfered with my radio. I can't call my friends for info. It's okay, Heavy, just do what Demo Man told you to do. I remember the time Demo got attacked by those things. It was good times. It looks like the iron cubes are still around. Maybe Demo and Engineer will tell me more soon. Oh. How long have you been stored here? All right, I'll do it. And when I do, you help guide me and tell me more about the facilities. Brace! Ah! Oh! Oh! What 
the fuck? What's going on? Transcript complete.